Some call the Oregon Trail a monument to human courage extending across two-thirds of the North American continent. It inspired visionary pioneers to seek the rich lands of the Pacific Northwest. That vision and commitment is still alive in Baker City. This spring, members from the community and their guests from around the Northwest celebrated the groundbreaking for the National Oregon Trail Interpretive Center located at Flagstaff Hill, a few miles from Baker City. This was a project developed through the partnership of local and state leaders, Oregon's congressional representatives, and BLM's Baker Resource Area in the Vale District. Dean Bibles, state director, spoke at the ceremony. Certainly a great pleasure on my part to be here today as we mark this important milestone in this pioneer partnership that was struck up several years ago here in Baker City uh, with the community, the state of Oregon, and the BLM, and many others around the state that have been interested in the promotion of the Oregon Trail and its heritage. For the BLM, this center continues our efforts to meet the increasing demand of our citizens for the many and varied recreational opportunities on the nation's public lands. It is a visible symbol of our commitment to multiple use. I think that one of the visions for the future is that this will be one of a series of interpretive sites that will be along the trail from Missouri to Oregon City. So I, I'm very pleased to be with you here today. We're gathered together to break the ground for this building, the Oregon Trail Interpretive Center. But in a larger sense, we're celebrating and renewing the partnership that got us this far. Let's keep that partnership strong as we head into the final stages of our journey together. Thank you. At Flagstaff Hill, former Governor Neil Goldschmidt and Governor Barbara Roberts cut the ribbon for the groundbreaking. Other dignitaries joined in the ceremony. The next step is for us to complete construction. Construction is planned to proceed from now all the way through uh, early May, late April of 1992. We have basically one year to complete the construction. And that includes both the site, the road, the building, as well as the interpretive displays and all the exhibitry that goes inside and outside the area. That should be completed and we should have our grand opening on May 25th, 1992, which is Memorial Day weekend. Today we also have, in conjunction with our ground baking ceremonies, a Wagon's Hole celebration. This is the second annual Wagon's Hole celebration. A volunteer group called the Trail Tenders organized the Wagon Hole part of the celebrations with an old-fashioned midway, food, displays, and live music. If this celebration is an indication of things to come, the Flagstaff Hill Interpretive Center will be a success.